hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys a few things that i got from nasty gal i haven't shopped at nasty gal in about a year and you know how boredom is it kind of leads you to places on the internet where you don't need to be so i just decided to log on and i found some really cute things some really nice things and some things i'm not really sure about so you guys can also help me out a bit and let me know what you think um let's get right into it so this dress at first when i tried it on i hated it and i think i still do it's amazingly cut i feel like this little sweetheart top the really cinched in bodice and then this ruching on the hips i feel like it's so great and the open back with this nice little tie is really cute the puff sleeves are structured these are lined you know a nice little sleeve cap the thing is the proportions are off they definitely are off as you can see i cannot move my legs further apart than this and you know it's just not <laughs> cut right it's way too big at the top and it's really small on the bottom i think that this is a great dress it doesn't work for me but if you're heavier on top and maybe you have narrower hips and really no thighs this would be good for you i think even if this had a zipper up the side that you could like you know just make a slit and like be able to move but it's like i really could not walk i can't even walk fast in this i would have to walk like this the whole time so yeah i'm really sad that this didn't work because it's such a great dress like this on paper is such a great dress but in practice like on the body it just doesn't work like it just doesn't work out in the streets this is Okay, so this dress, for whatever reason, I purchased this in three sizes. So this is the US 4. I like this dress. I am not sure I 100% love it. It's definitely in the same vein as the Jacquemus Aries dress. And so I want to kind of try a trend, but I'm not a trend girl. I'm really not. So I, you know, gave it a try. I think that it is cute. I don't know how flattering the style is on me just because I feel like a dress like this, you either need the body for the cut or you need structure. So I feel like for me, because it's a little bit of a more basic cut, you know, it's not like cinched at the waist. It doesn't have darts and pleats and all, well, actually, yes, it does. <laughs> actually, it does have some fit detailing. So I can't say that, but I do think that it's a little bit too flimsy for me, maybe. You guys tell me, I'm open to deciding whether I should keep it because I feel like this is a good like night out dress like you could be going out with your girls you could be going out with your man and just you know want to look cute but kind of like you know corporate sexy <laughs> I think is is the look obviously you wouldn't wear this to the office but you could definitely wear it out and just have like a little bit of like look here not here look here not here like <laughs> just have a little play with it you know it's all about fit it's all about what you're comfortable in i do love that there are shoulder pads because i think it just gives the look again a little more structure and a little more substance to it i'm a quality girl so i'm always going to choose something that feels better over something that looks okay i think if you have a more athletic body type or you're very thin this will look good on you because it will create it'll create like a v-neck and give you some cleavage it'll create some space here and kind of like give you a waist if you don't really have one but i think if you already have curves this may not be the best dress for you because it's also gonna kind of like hide them in the in the spaces where you want to accentuate for reference this is the larger size this is the size six instead of the size four it does fit a lot better just because i can like move a little bit easier in it and then the top is not like gaping but i still think it needs more structure because i would want it to just be down you know just like more weight i think the fabric doesn't have enough weight da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da. <laughs> You know, 
I was ready to hate this also, but I kind of like it. And I will say that the fabric is definitely a little bit heavier, even though I did check and it is polyester. I feel like it just has a little bit more weight to it. It's a lined blazer dress. It is very nice. I can give you a close up on how the fabric looks, but um, you know, you can see that it has a little bit of a texture to it. I like this because it does have a little bit of structure. It's double breasted. There is, well, I'm naked under here, but um, there is an inside button. So you know when you have a blazer, especially a double breasted blazer, a lot of times you'll just button this button, but then it kind of like sags in here because there's nothing anchoring it to this side of your body. So it's great that there's an inside button in here to keep this secure. I do really like that. And I like how it feels, you know, it feels nice. The length is great. I think it looks good from the back. You could definitely get this tailored more so that it's even more structured, you know, just a little bit more detailing so that it feels like this is yours, like it's custom. And I know that a lot of people want to look expensive on a budget. I feel like this is a great piece to purchase and then have tailored and it's going to make you look like a million bucks, especially in this ivory. It's just going to, it sings, you know, <laughs> this on the body, it sings. So I think that definitely I was ready to hate this, but I like it, I like it, I like it. You know, like you could wear this out to like a nice brunch. You could wear this to meet the parents. You could wear this if you're more modest on a date night. You could wear this anywhere. You could wear this to your kids fundraiser if you're like the pta mom you're the president of the pta you want to let those pta moms know <laughs> i'm the head p in charge i'm the head parent in charge <laughs> this is a great dress for that and you can obviously put it with you know a heel you can put this with like your flats i don't do wedges i don't do wedges so no wedges <laughs> but you know you can really wear this with anything and it's gonna look great okay so obviously i feel like this trend of blazer dress has just infiltrated my mind <laughs> obviously we've seen pink everywhere this season and i think pink looks good on everyone i think it's like white it just once you find your shade and a nice shape for a dress or a top, you can make pink work for you. I didn't wear pink a lot, but I think now that I'm feeling it this season, I'm just going for it. You've been seeing a lot of pink in a lot of my other hauls. And if you haven't, make sure that you check out my last Zara haul. But yeah, I like this blazer. I think that it's really nice. I don't wanna hate everything in this haul, but I think that the material is too light. It's too flimsy. And it just makes me feel like I'm wearing a napkin or a tissue. Looks wise, I think it, it's great. But I think even when I move, you can tell that this is not a heavy garment. And so that bothers me. <laughs> it bothers me. I can't help it. Um, you know, I think it's just something about what I like but I think that this is a great dress for anyone who is looking for a pink blazer dress, especially, again, this is like a Jacquemus style dress and, you know, a trend that I think has been going on for a little while, which is why you can kind of find a pink blazer dress like this almost anywhere, but it just doesn't do what it needs to do. It's not giving what it needs to give. And for me, that is just all that I need to know, so. <laughs> This is the drama that I deserve. This is just everything. <laughs> so this dress was honestly what kind of sparked my whole nasty gal shopping spree. <laughs> it was just such an interesting dress and an interesting dress for me particularly because I don't do bright, bold colors like this very often. And then if it's such a bold, you know, silhouette, and it's also like not as fitted to the body. So it just was all around something different for me to try. And I think that I really love it. I think it does reflect my personality. 
and you know this is like it's giving a little shoulder with some jewelry this could be nice with hair pulled back this could be nice um but you know it's like very loose it's very samba it's giving different vibes that i could definitely get on board with so for that reason i think this is a great dress anybody can wear this if you have a tiny body type you're very petite you don't have boobs you do have boobs you do have thighs you don't have thighs you have huge arms you have small arms no matter what <laughs> this dress is gonna look great on you um it does need a bit of a seam so that these are a little bit fluffier but other than that this is a pretty great low maintenance dress and it's gonna look good on anyone um and then this across the shoulders is pretty comfortable it's pretty secure i got a four i could have gotten a two um and i think it would just be shorter but you know it would have less fabric around but i don't think the size is really something to scrutinize over because if you get your size it's gonna fit you if you get a size smaller it's gonna fit you just maybe a little bit shorter so yeah i think this is the love of the haul definitely didn't love everything in the haul but this i really enjoy and i could see myself wearing this out in the summer and it just being super easy to put on and like oh what am i gonna wear tonight i know i can just throw this on and feel great about it there is one more thing that i did buy and i thought about not showing it but i think that it's really cute so i will just show it to you it's this diamante crystal bra now this is like stuff that i love like this is so my vibe um if you follow me on instagram you know that i have like a little chainmail top that gives off this same vibe but i just thought this was so cute and just so like fun and playful for the summer it definitely doesn't cover my whole breast but that's fine like i can wear it over something and it just be really gorgeous i think there's definitely a piece of me that is lil kim foxy brown like i think a little bit of that is in my personality just being a 90s kid and being free and uninhibited and just feeling good about myself and you know everything that makes me a woman i feel like that's who bought this because <laughs> this is definitely for later but yes um yeah that is the haul i hope that you guys enjoyed it i hope that it was helpful for you especially with sizing and you know fabrics materials cuts colors structure i want to give you as much information and detail as possible in these hauls so let me know what looks you like let me know if you hated all the looks like i did um let me know what you might be buying and what stores i should do a haul with next yeah, because i'm just a shopping machine so let me know and i cannot wait to see you guys in my next one make sure that you like this video make sure that you give it a big thumbs up and comment down below what things you want to see next again don't forget to subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one don't forget to subscribe don't forget to subscribe